It's Jeffrey Howells Carpet Cleaning here, and we've got ourselves some pretty uh, torn up. Um, this is open commercial glue down carpeting that we're going to be using today, cleaning up. And we're going to be using the Commercial Magic and the Detonator. Now, um, the Commercial Magic is, is uh, like a synthetic carpet um, cleaning chemical that breaks the water tension so that we can rinse the carpets. Because generally what happens when you're dealing with uh, olefin or, you know, a lot of your, these carpets, a lot of them, they're just made out of recycled plastic. So what they like to do is absorb oils and they don't like to uh, allow you to rinse them with water. So it retains a lot of that nasty stuff when you're rinsing it. So um, you need to use a solution that breaks down so that you're allowed to rinse the carpets now, um, we did go over this area here, and what we use is uh, the Commercial Magic. We spread it down, then we use the CRB with black brushes on it. Now, typically, you'd probably be wanting to use brown or gray brushes, but uh, that's all we have are these tile cleaning brushes. And on, you know, really hard fastened, you got to look for the integrity of the carpet. You don't want to be using it on something where it's going to snag a stray and you know, line and rub it clear across the carpeting like Berber or something like that. But these are in very well good condition and they're just going to get a good scrub. Um, I pre-sprayed this area here. You can see it's actually since I pre-sprayed it, it looks a lot better, but you can see that there's that dinge there. Um, this side had an identical spot. However, that's all that's left, and that looks so much better than what it was. So what we're going to do is we're going to give it a scrub with the Commercial Magic using the, the CRB, and then we are going to go back and we're going to give it a light extraction, the hot water extraction, give it a good steam out. Probably be running about 250 to 300 PSI just because we're doing some pretty massive uh, agitation. And once you do that, the soil suspension is, you know, occurring. You're getting the, the product in the carpet. You're giving it a good scrub, and it doesn't necessarily need to be pounded with 600-plus pounds of water at that point. Okay, with just a scrub using the Commercial Magic and the Detonator product, you can see that it looks pretty darn good. I mean, you can still see there's a desk there, and there's a desk here, but on this other side, they've, they've almost completely vanished. I mean, you can sort of see what may have been a desk here, and a little bit over there, but I think as the, the product dwells in the carpet, I think it's just going to lift out more and more. So we're going to go ahead, we're going to pre-treat and scrub the rest of the place, and then uh, we'll run our lines in and give it a quick steam out. Okay, I'm going to do a little bit of before and after with the scrub um, with the Commercial Magic, just so that you can kind of see some of the, the, the before and after benefits of what it's going to do. Um, this here is pretty, pretty rough in here, so we'll go ahead and just give this a scrub, and I'll show you uh, the difference that we make with just a scrub. Right, I gave this a good scrub, gave it some sufficient dwell time, and you can already see nine day difference. Now, with the little traffic area in front of the door there, when we go over with our hot water extraction, it'll probably just dirt and stuff, and sand that is um, pounded down on the carpet there, and we'll just lift it out. So, anyways, the commercial magic seems to be a winner.